All right, let's start round one of playoffs in three, two, one, go. All right, the robots have started the tele the autonomous period. It looks like over on the blue lines, they have a middle and a high cube, and 5188 is placing that high cube for the blue alliance. Over on the red alliance, they have two high cubes and a middle cube as well. The driver control period has now started. It looks like all the teams are going for game pieces to score on their grids this match. 5010 is going to their human player station when 5188 grabs the cone and 1646 grabs the cube for the blue alliance. 1646 is making their way over to the grid as 5188 places their game piece in the top knot. 5010 places a cone on that top node for the Red Alliance to score some points. Just a reminder, these teams are trying to make different links made out of three game pieces to earn ranking points and extra points. 5188 is going for that top cone node while their Alliance partners are still grabbing more game pieces from the other human player station. It looks like 461 is grabbing another cone to try and complete their grid over on the Red Alliance side. Right now, the score is 30 to 50 in favor of the Red Alliance. There's 74 seconds left. There's still plenty of points that are able to be made in this match. It looks like 1646 is going for that. Another cube on the top. Now all of those cube notes are filled and they just need to place those cones there. Over on the Red Alliance, we have two links going on and they are working on more. Just a reminder to the audience, for those watching, the lower level is worth two points, middle level is worth three points, and the top level is worth five points for each element scored. There are 36 seconds left in the match, and it is 35-76 in favor of the Red Alliance. And that sound means that the end game period has now began and teams are able to balance on that charge station. It looks like 1747 is already going for that charge. And 1646 is placing one last cube before getting on that balancing pad. It looks like the Red Alliance is going for the triple dock and they are successful! And the Blue Alliance is going for that double dock. There are five seconds left. Three, two, one. And that is our playoff number one. That was Alliance number one versus Alliance number eight. Let's take a look at the results in a few minutes. All right, let's take a look at the results. Congratulations to the Red Alliance. The Red Alliance wins 112 to 62. Just a reminder, no one will be eliminated after this match. The Red Alliance will advance to the upper bracket round two, match seven, and the Blue Alliance will advance to the lower bracket round two, match five. They have one more chance to keep in this game.